We'll guide you through how to fix an eSIM not working in an iPhone. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. This problem can be annoying because you're then unable to go and use it. So we'll guide you through some different fixes you can try. For the first fix, you want to go and open up your settings. Go down and go and find mobile service. In some countries, it will be called cellular. Tap there. Go into Sims and you'll go and see the different options here. You then want to go and tap on the one you're having the problem with. First of all, make sure that it is turned on. If it is currently turned on, you can try turning it off and then back on. Sometimes doing this can go and solve the problem. Go and see if it does. What you can also do here is go and choose in the mobile data and default voice line which SIM is used. Next, try doing a forced restart. Press the volume increase, then decrease and hold down the side power button. Shortly, the phone screen will go black. Keep it held down until you see the Apple icon and it'll then come back on. Go and see if it's then solved. If it still isn't, come back to your settings and come back to mobile service or cellular. Come and tap on the SIM. Scroll down and what you can do is go and press delete. Delete it like so, go and add it again. Just make sure you can go and re-add it. Sometimes with some e-sims, they won't allow you to. So check that with your carrier. 